Hello, in this chapter, we're going to be concentrating on our chin area and our lower lip. We want to uh, load them up. So I we've already shaved our cheeks and we've done two passes on our neck and our cheeks. And we're going to finish up our mustache area. So I'm going to just load some soap on there. Okay, like I told you before, you can close your lips and just run your finger across your lips. That'll clean that up and just keep it out of your nose. Okay, so what we're going to do today is we're going to work on cleaning up the mustache area. So what you want to do is you want to pull the skin again, make sure that you're pulling your skin taut. You want to stretch your mouth and you want to run your razor at an angle down over this area of your mouth, like so. And you blow out, remember, stretch your lips, whatever you have to do. To get this area right here nice and clean and then I'm going to start in the center with my razor and come down right to my lower lip. I'm stretching to flatten it out like so. Just like that and I'm going to work this side of my face and then this side of my face. I'm using my opposite hands for this particular thing. Very nice. Okay, now I'm gonna do the same thing running from my uh, my lower lip down to my chin area and popping out with my tongue in there like this okay this is a tricky area when you get to this section what you want to do is you want to bring the razor down like this and you want to come around your chin like this. So you're going to be using, like I use my thumb to turn that blade. So you're going to be using that to turn around the edge. Just like that. And you're going to run all the way across your cheek, right to the edge of your cheek from your lip. Excellent. And then what I'll do is I'll run my blade across just like this to, and stretch. To get this area right here and now this whole section of my face is completely done I'm gonna throw a little more soap on just to show you guys and then what I'm doing is I'm gonna switch my hand and I'm gonna do my right side of my face with my left hand like this 
So I'm going to do the same exact thing I did, just the opposite direction. Excellent. Very good. And remember, you're going to pull over your cheekbone from right here by your cheekbone. Pull that skin up when you're coming across. You're going to right at the crease of your mouth to get that area right here. You're going to come down again from this side. Remember that motion is down and around, down and around like that. And I'm going to come across just to this way to get this area. Excellent. Remember, always stretch that skin wherever you have to to get the closest shave. Now, that's one. That's going to be your first pass. So when you do your first pass completely, you're going to do that included in your first pass. So your first pass will include your right cheek, your left cheek, your neck, and then when you finish your neck, you're going to do your mustache and your chin area and your lips. Then when you go through for your second pass, what I do is I don't feel a need on my second pass to have to go against because I get a pretty, pretty close shave just like this. So I'm going to lather back up. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit that section one more time. I'm just going to get an idea of where I need. So I'm going to do the same thing. Just I'm going to I'm going to run it across like this a little more so that I'm getting a little more of that crosshair for a cross. Remember, always stretch, blow out, stretch your skin however you need to. Very nice. All right here, I need a little hit right here. Pretty much what this second pass is on your lip area and your chin. For me, it's just a touch up is what I'm doing. The rest of this is fairly good, so I really don't need to touch that up. 
So you're going to use that second pass on this area, and you're going to determine how much of a second pass you really need. Um, there is one more, one more pass that some guys do. I don't. I prefer not to do it. I'm going to show you really quick what I do, just so you get an idea. So I'm going to throw a quick lather. Okay, so what they do is, you're going to hold your razor like this, with your fingers on the spine, both on the spine. You're going to roll your lower lip and your upper lip so that it's really taut, and then you're going to hold your razor and you're going to run it up, upward, doing a against the grain on your mustache. I'm going to do it, but... It's very dangerous, and I prefer that you take your time. If you want to try this, be very, very careful. Um, I don't usually do this, so I'm going to show you anyway so that you guys understand how it's done. So you're doing exactly what I'm showing you. You're just going to run that blade with both of your hands holding the blade by the spine, and you're going to run it up your mustache, rolling your lip so that you have it nice and taut. When you're doing this, the blade is perpendicular to your face. So it's almost exactly flat on your mustache area. There is no angle, it's straight up. Just so you guys know. And I'm gonna just show you this really quick. This is a little tiny bit of soap right here. But if you could see how much more mustache hair that took off, that little tiny bit, but it's going completely against the grain. So if you prefer to try that, you guys are absolutely welcome. That's a huge learning curve. So take your time. Um, when you're working your mustache area, be very careful. Watch out for your, no your nose and your nostril area. Your chin, you're going to remember to always roll. You're going to take your razor and you're going to roll it. Roll it around the edge, just like this, around your chin so that you can come down far enough where you're catching your whole chin in, in the shave. Just like that. Okay, guys? Well, this concludes my tutorial of how I interpret my straight shave. And um, I hope you guys got something from it. Um, if you did and you enjoyed watching my videos, please leave comments below. Also, all of my tutorial videos have links below them as to where you can buy fantastic soaps and razors and um, honing equipment, strops, everything that you would need to start off straight razor shaving.